Welcome to the 12th issue of the Great British Locomotive Collection. I'm at my sister's house, that's why a different location. Um, this is the Fowler 3F Ginty class. This is the uh, 1924 LMS. Wheel arrangement 060, number 7279. So if I try and get her out. Is. There's always good detail. There's a cab in there. I've got a screwdriver so I can't take them off this time. I don't think the wheels go round, they never do. And as usual they have a pitch on the back there, as you can see, it's a bridge, going over a bridge, nice countryside there, and as per usual they never update that picture, so it's the same pitch on the back, let's have a look at the magazine. Nice pitch on the front, the uh, Ginty class. And then they always tell you what's going on next week, or in two weeks' time, once every two weeks. Issue 13 is the Castle class. It's a versatile design. Uh, these powerful six-wheeled tanks were the standard heavy shunting en engine of the LMS, but in reality they were much more than that. They filled a void in the ranks of LMS motive power, able to handle the odds and ends that were either beneath or too much of other locomotives of the day. So they were quite a powerful engine. <coughs> Middle inspiration. came from the early Midland Railway design, the origin of the, let's go back to 1868. This one's um, at the, at the Crinklewood Shed, July 27, 1935. Standard Hermes Heavy Shunter Loco. Almost new LMS number six six oh one sorry one six six oh eight with coal trained from Haydock Colliery in nineteen twenty eight. Notice in that photograph they got like the newer signals rather than the uh ones with the things go up and down. Oh, those are the atomy, like the chimney, the boiler, the water tank, the livery which means the letters, the cylinder, that's the driving wheel, but the 
opportunity duties. Fulham site across networking, British Railways, London, Midland region. The regional engines remained on home territory, which included South Wales, which became part of the LMS Western Division until the 1930s. Rivals compared. Trading places. Look, there's um, emptying the coal onto a canal. Uh, XLMS Ginty number 47445 sold out service, including use at the DOCP British Oak Coal Screens, Green Coal Stone in 1966. I don't think you'd find that anymore. Putting coal from trains to barges. It's a very unfamiliar sight. New lease of life. Great Central Railway number 47406. Seen at Yaxman during a visit to the Mid Norfolk Railway. Where can they always do that far away? I can see one. Uh, Oxen Hope, really engineering, but live somewhere. Great Central Railway, Midland Railway, Butley undergoing restoration. Just some places. And as always, on the back. Look, that's the same photo as they on there. I've never done that before. That photo is the same one as that. Working hard up the grade with five coaches in tow. Number 47279 across Merthelone's Viaduct up on the Cayley and Worth Valley Railway. Well, that's it. One last look at the locomotive. That's it there. Thanks for watching, bye.